Welcome well, back. welcome back. Three Minute Grill. Yeah, Sam from Triple S Farms is here because, uh, you know, Fat Tuesday's next week, so exactly. we might as well eat up. And I don't think we're going to eat the bacon. I think it turned out okay. Okay. Oh, so, yeah. what did we, what, remind us what bacon we made? Bacon fixes everything, though. Okay, yeah. It? Okay, so it's a jambalaya. Now we did it. And I did, did uh, carillo chorizo or something jambalaya. It's the red. It's got the tomato sauce. <laughs> he doesn't even know. I can't pronounce it. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway. It's basically it's simple ingredients, four ingredients. It's got rice, protein, which is the meats. We used our andouille, uh, chicken, our chicken, and shrimp, which we sell shrimp too, so you can come to me at the market and get it. Mm -hmm. And then it's got the veg mix in it, and uh, which was peppers, uh, onion, and celery. And mm -hmm. then it's got the spices. We put a little cayenne in there. To, not that it needed it, but just add a little bit to it. So... Of course, you see okay. measurements on your screen there, but we did not actually measure anything. Yeah, so I don't know. Kind of yeah. threw it all you together. Know. The results may rookies, vary. And I'm a rookie, so I don't, you know. Okay, first of all, it smells fantastic in here, and it really does look great. Yeah, You're surprised. I, I am shocked. <laughs> He was shy. He's like, this actually turned out yeah, okay. I was really shocked. I mean, you know, there's no better time to experiment on things on, on live television. Yeah, exactly. You know. we're, we're good guinea pigs. I'm fine with that. Do you have a little fork over there, Spoon? Do, I, do, we, need yeah. to, do we need to sprinkle the finishing touches on Yeah, I'll let garnish. you do that. I'll let you do your own. <laughs> yeah, a little parsley on that. Uh, we well, need to talk to management and get real china out here. <laughs> <laughs> there, there you go. <laughs> but, then, but then, Stan, we'd have to do the dishes. Then we'd uh, have to do the dishes, <laughs> and, and, and I don't know how. There. You know, I love cooking with cast iron, but you know what? Hauling that stuff in here this morning, I'm like, you know, if you're going to go up in the mountains backpacking, <laughs> you'd have to hire somebody just to haul your, your pots and pans That's a nice around. Yeah, I don't know if that oh, Yeah, yeah, yeah Tupperware is a lot lighter. Really good. Yeah. Yeah, okay. This well, good. did turn out well. Good deal. Um, And it's really a good time to have something like this, it's like comfort food. Mm -hmm. I felt great. I was sitting there stirring. I felt like the old timers in this big old cast iron <laughs> pot, you know. <laughs> Probably need a few six pack over here or something to eat. In this with. luxurious log cabin. I like the sound of that. Yeah. I like where your head's at, Stan. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, the we Germans, all? you know, the Germans was involved in this, so you know there's beer there, alcohol there somewhere. So, yeah. Stan Dewey is really good. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. So, we also learned the difference today between this and gumbo. There is right. a difference. Correct. Yeah. What was that? Yeah. Okay, this here has the rice mixed with it, the gumbo. This is, is a stew form, and it's poured on top of the rice. So, gotcha. So okay. this one, you, you don't want this to be totally... And this is the way I like it, because the rice absorbs the flavor. Uh -huh. You know, and actually, you could put this in the fridge overnight and heat it up the next day, and it would even be better, because that rice is going to soak all Ooh, that. Oh, yeah, you're so right. Soak all that in, so... But That's it's not like leftovers, right, oh, Stan? there you go. <laughs> we get us a big 10-gallon pot, and we'll make a whole batch, mm -hmm. and everybody yep. have a party. And when you put it together, you want it to be kind of inconsistent as far as the texture. Right, right? Yeah. exactly. Right, right. Yeah. That's what makes the gumbo, and it's got the... Look at you, Aaron. It's, ve it's very not <laughs> homogenous. <laughs> Everybody's an expert today. That's true. I'm, I'm, I try, Shingle try on my door says farmer. It don't say cook or chef, so, I, you know, I'm just winging it here. Um, you know what? I'm a professional eater, so I'm cool with that. We all are. We're right. with that. <laughs> we're all eaters, so. Thanks, right, Stan, Stan, for thank being you here. So much. Okay, thank you. Appreciate it. Have a good and time. And thank you all for watching. Yeah. Make it a great day.